So, uh, yeah, I don't know. The amount of tools you have on a pest control truck is laughable. So what I'm working with here is going to be kind of humorous to you guys. But uh, it's what I got to work with. So exactly we can find out here. Sorry guys, you picked a stupid spot to hide. I'm gonna try to keep my language on the uh, parental friendly side on this video. They're actually wasps, they're not bees. Uh, you can tell because they're not fuzzy. And they're actually, their bodies are in three parts. The bees are only in two. If they were bees, we wouldn't be killing them. Flashlight. See if I can see anything. Oh, I actually do see the nest. Hold on, guys. I kind of see it back there. See it? I found it, guys. Woohoo! So it's like kind of in this general area, um, I'm gonna try to hollow it out as much as I can. Maybe I can get my tripod over on this side so I can catch a better view when I pull it out. That is the nest up in there. So uh, I'll be right back. I think I'm gonna turn the flash on and uh, try to set it up somewhere so you can see me pull it out nice. So I'll be back, guys. Alright, 
So, as you can see, our nest is right up in here. Um, I don't know. I'm not gonna be able to rip this whole tree down to get to that. So, I'm just gonna kind of jam my arm up in there and see what we can grab down. It's not even where the next is, huh? Huh? New issue, that wasn't the nest. <laughs> Alright, well, hold on a minute. A little bit more arm fishing, and uh, that actually is the nest up there. There's like the first layer, you can see a ton of larvae. A very active nest. It just goes up in there. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see it, but... Hopefully, you got a view of it in there, because I can't see it. Only way for me to get it is to go arm fishing. And uh, that's what we're gonna have to do here. So let me set you up. Kind of sucks because I really can't see up there. All I can do is fish around and I'm still getting a bunch, so hey. Man guys, get off my hands. I feel like Yogi Bear. Oh, this dude's stinging like crazy, look at him, he's trying to get away. Can't. They really like stinging the hands, I'm telling you. And it feels like, oh no, got another little chunk down there. Dude, there are like so many on my hands, it's ridiculous. Get off of me, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> it's hard to tell what's tree and what's bee nest. It's not the funnest thing in the world to do right here. Any more up there, guys? Right, that was the end of it right there. Got my arm like pretty good up in that tree. A lot more than I thought I'd be able to at least. All right. So, that was what was in this tree. It was actually a hell of a lot more than I was expecting. So for like size perspective here, so I'm kind of zoomed in currently.
the size of my hand next to the nest. It was a, a decent amount of nest, but nothing too crazy. Let's see if we can see back in our tree here. Shelling. It's a solid tree up in there. Got my arm pretty deep up in this tree. And yeah. So that's what we were working with. Got a little piece of nest down there. Doesn't look like there's nothing downward. There's some bees because I knocked some spots down there. in the tree or down in the roots no activity down there look in the trees there kind of just chilling in there you see some of them that guy they're crawling around in there still but uh their home's all gone Nothing left. So, yeah. I didn't think we were going to be able to do anything in tree stump, but I can zoom out. That's all in all pretty successful, guys. Awesome job. Here with my bare hand again. Up in there. That all looks good. Alright, well, this one ended up being pretty good. I like it, guys. See you next time.